I'm a very honest person. I didn't take anything. Empty your pockets now. <laughs> Qu'est-ce qui va le plus te manquer dans Indiana Jones? I don't think I'm going to miss anything at all. I'm very satisfied with the whole experience. What you miss are the people that you work with. You forget that he's, you know, 79, 80 years old. Um, he'll, he's got more stamina than any of us, I think. And you forget that he's, uh, he's a legend because he mm -hmm. is, he's there to work and he makes you feel comfortable and so we can dive into the scenes together. Yeah, incredibly playful and, and generous and master of the craft. And I think he takes that you know, seriously, but um, is, is willing to, to be effusive with, with his colleagues. Phoebe, were you nervous at the idea of with Harrison? I, I was, until we spoke for the first time. Harrison just has this amazing way of relaxing everybody. Uh, because everyone, when you do, everyone is like, oh, it's Harrison at the beginning, you have to admit. A little bit. No, he doesn't have to say anything. Qui était le plus marrant sur le plateau? I don't think anybody was trying to be the funniest. I was trying so hard to be the funniest. <laughs> was I funny? Hell yes, he was funny. <laughs> still trying. Yeah. Still no, trying. Still trying. <laughs> I think for me it was uh, just a wonderful introduction to American cinema and American culture um, to see this kind of bit of an anti-hero be celebrated for his humanity. Um, and I was really young when I started and it, for also for me it was just as dark as it actually is was really funny and I thought it was just the absurdity of it and the humor of it um, was something that really delighted me. Yeah, it was a, a time in like the 80s and for me where E.T. and Steven Spielberg films were in the theaters and you could go watch them. It was a whole thing about always going to the movies. So yeah, it was a, a big part of my childhood. It came out, I didn't go to the movie theaters and I, I actually I remember why now because my brother had two different girlfriends who worked in movie theaters and normally we would go there for free. Yeah. But that was a break in between here apparently. Yeah. So, we, uh, so we went out and we rented the thing on a VHS and we watched it five times uh, and it just blew us away. We, we'd never seen anything like it and, and it was... Just... Later on it became an inspiration just watching it, it just became like you wanted to be Indiana Jones. Pourquoi avoir renfilé le chapeau et le fouet pour un cinquième opus? I always wanted to see this character at the end of his career. I wanted to see him age as I have aged. You can see that I'm an older person. I wanted to tell that story about this character and and what what happened to him. The story is is a beautiful story which ends in a way that I think uh, is very emotionally satisfying. Be well. Bye. Bye.